Frankie says, let's not try and make an intro. An intro? That's fine. This is what we're looking at here. It is a knife menage a trois. Uh -huh. We're going to have to sort them. Yes. And we're going to start doing that now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, we had a recent conversation on Instagram with Mr. Scurvy. Shout out. Mr. Scurvy. Yeah, you have to say it like that. Uh -huh. What's the best knife? Okay. What's the best knife non-flipper in the $50 to $70 range? Mm, that's a lot. Okay. So we were having that conversation, okay, over there. Yeah. But then I thought that would make a good video. It would make a good but video. But let's just go ahead and say 70 and under. Oh, okay. Well, there's a lot of good options. That opens it up a little bit more. There's a lot more options. Yeah. Even around, you're, you guys will see, $20, $30. There's a couple in here that you could have bought for $12. Yeah, that's true. That are really, <laughs> that are really good. Yeah. All right, first of all, so this is, um, we're going with manual knife, thumb stud. Yes, and you have a couple of autos in here that we need to kick out immediately because you have these in here. Go ahead. It's not a flipper. No, but it is an automatic. Okay, that's the Boker Kalishnikov. There's a ton of varieties yeah. of these. They you can get them all price ranges, too. I want to say they start around 35 bucks. Yeah. You just they, wanted to show off your edge to it. They don't come with that edge. No. no. We'll go ahead and set these aside. The Lightning. It's an OTF. You can get a good OTF. I think it's 440C. <laughs> you call that a good OTF? I do. Okay. I've had this for five years. I it's know. It's great. It's distressed. 20 bucks. Yes, that's a good knife. Okay. And then you have this one out here too, the new Boker Kaihan. Kaihan. Is that how you pronounce it? Yes, yes. 60 or so? 50 to 60. 50 to 60, yeah. Um, but do they count? Probably not. All no. Right. Let's get into it. There's what else? There's something else in here. What else? Oh, okay. You have the little damn designs Oni. Does a front flipper count? No. no. Probably not. It does not because it's, it's technically a flipper and these are supposed to be non flippers. Okay. Oh, you're doing reach around. <laughs> What? That's these, what you were doing. What do these start at? It's worth mentioning. Like 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Now, we'll set those aside. Technically, probably not. You have the Metamorph in here, too. Real Still Metamorph. This is the Indiana Knives exclusive version. There's a bunch of different colors of these, too. What are these? Around 60? Yeah. Something but like front that. front flipper... I don't know why you even brought them in. Well, the conversation, I just, for this for the sake of this video, oh, okay. why not? But the conversation was more of a traditional style knife as a gift for a father-in-law. Oh, gotcha. Specifically okay. is what it was. So these are all going to be, well, most are going to be manual knives. Yeah, um, I can see With that. thumb studs or thumb slots. Mm, yeah. Right, okay. Where should we start, slots. Frankie? Where should we start? Um, we could start at the least expensive? The least expensive? Sure. Okay. Well, no, because no, then we'll have to sort through them all Oh, that okay. If you're talking least expensive, why not? There's yeah. the Shuffle 1. This is by Kershaw. This is a manual thumb stud. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Smooth. Anyway. There you go. <laughs> Shut up. You can this get is... these for free sometimes. You can get them for like 6 bucks to 12 I think regular price is as much as 20 bucks. I'm yeah. not sure. Yeah. They're okay, but we recommend the Shuffle 2. This thing I carried in my work bag for, I think, good three years just to have. Yeah. It's just a good, like, beater. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You could say it's a master beater if you really wanted to do that. Um, bottle opener. Even, I think I used, like, the... Well, everything here thing you can it. get here. Yeah. This is the Shuffle 2. Well, and a tip. Wait, is that line. tip up or tip down? Tip, tip up. It's tip up. See, yeah. this is tip down. Well, it's reversible, too. Well, this is left and right, yeah. Oh, yeah, this one is, too. I didn't realize that. Okay. But this is tip down. So I guess that's something to consider. These are about 20 bucks. Yeah, but, yeah, you can find them really cheap, too. Sure, okay. A couple of Kershaws there. Frankie. Can we just talk about the Kershaws? Because Go Because there's a lot of Kershaws you can get in that price These range. These are discontinued. Kershaw Injection. This is the three inch version. There's also a 3.5 inch version. You could get these when they were on sale at Blade HQ. You could get these for 12 bucks. <laughs> it was such a good deal. There's a lot of Kershaws that so you can hop on sales and get them for dirt cheap. This is a Todd Rexford design liner lock. Uh, I mean, it's nothing special material wise, but, but it's a good basic knife. It's excellent. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if you can get one, go for it. You could throw this in there. This is part of that um, Christmas pack. This is the. The 2019 Christmas pack. You got three knives and then the K thing. Oh, here it is right here. 
for 20 bucks. So that's like a great present for anybody. Yeah, this was the thumb stud knife out of those three. Yeah. It's kind of small, but I don't know, for 20 bucks. I don't know, it has good... Mm. I, I was going to say it has good deployable action, but then you're... Go for it. You better get it, it first off. time. Okay, fine. Put it away. <laughs> okay, pretty much any Kershaw's out there, but if you can find them that are not assisted. Non-flippers. Yeah. Okay. Okay, what else we got here? Um, let's see, I guess uh, it doesn't matter here. What, what does the piglet go for? This is the, the QSP piglet. It's about $42. The heck there, there's glitter on the table oh yeah i did wrap some christmas presents <laughs> so annoying i know you hate it it's can, a good open it area i can't i can see it sometimes in the light there all right got it. qsp piglet these go for 42 bucks mm -hmm. see our video on this by the way see our video on any pretty much any of them just search birdshot and the knife and you'll, <laughs> you'll find it um what is this one though what's the blade steel 14c 28n the swedish steel yeah these He's are, a Swedish piglet. <laughs> <laughs> These are decent. These are decent. Mm -hmm. 42 bucks? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Frankie, what else we got? Oh, um, you got you got your hand on it. The Vector. This is the Tangram Vector. We won't speak of the deals that happened l this time last Christmas. But there are a lot of Tangram slash Kaiser deals out there right now. I'm going to yeah. put with this. Thank you. You could get this thing for like $13 last year. D I said don't say that. Oh, I'm just saying. Where is the you, Tangram? Who knows? Normal price on this, $31. Yeah. It is, what's the steel in these? The. I think it's Swedish also. No, it's, it's not. What is it? I'm looking through the camera here. Oh, it's a Kudo. A Kudo 440. Yeah, yeah I've sharpened a little bit of this. It's good. It's good. It gets a good edge. It does. And uh, does a button lock qualify? Well, you're not going to get too many button locks in this price range. But... You're not going to get this color in aluminum and everything. If you can score one of these for the under 20 bucks deal, get one. Because they are awesome for that price range. Get one for $31. Yeah, that's true too. It's good for that. Don't feel bad if you buy for $31. It's yeah. good. Yeah, it is. Yeah, Tangram Vector. Okay, so then if you're springing up a little bit, you can go to the if you're Kaiser's. springing up, go ahead. The Kaiser Begleiters. No, this is the Doman. Mini Doman. Yeah, yeah. And this is the N690. And for some reason, we don't have the large one anymore. No, we might. Or but we those are right about 50 bucks. Okay. The Mini or the regular. I think that's the sale price right now. Yeah. At Blade HQ. We'll put some links in. This, very similar to the Beg Letter. Yes. Trade but the Beg Letter is a little bit skinnier. Trade you. Yeah, true. And I love this color. I love it so much. Well, there's lots of colors in all of these varieties. And you're getting a little bit better steel with that. They're 154 CM. So if you're springing up, you know, $20, $30, you're going to probably get a little bit better steel out there oh. than, say, the Kershaw's. Forty dollars is the sale price on some of the minis. Oh, that's such a good deal. Where is okay full size? This is going to be one of the best out of the group. Yeah. Kaiser bag letter. And it just does have that traditional styling that it would be great for any person out there for a gift. It won't have that edge. No. No. no this is on Japanese VG10. Yeah. The the blade steel will be comparable. It won't necessarily be VG10 though. Yeah. Uh, I thumb think they knife. Them. Around well. 50 to 60 is probably, 50 is probably just the sale price. Well, and think about it too. Anybody would love to get that as a present. I think it would just be one of those great ones that anybody would like. Um, it's high up on my list. All three yeah. of these are high up on my list for this. Yeah. I guess we're going to go across the way here. This one doesn't count. Not really. This He's an assisted. Sog blank. It's assisted. It's thumb studs. It's a great carry knife. That's what mustard does when you leave it on. <laughs> Yeah, no, those are discontinued, and they really should still exist. I know, they That's really the should. It was there. like Sog's like last good one. Okay, then this is the CRKT CEO, mm -hmm. new for this year, and it is was awesome. That, was that a full deployment? Yeah, it was. Okay. It's locked in. It just was very slow. Here. There. There's more thwapping action. Thwapping? thwapping. I think you're kind of confusing something else. Okay. This version, how much are they? Um, that one CRKT, is forty bucks. Forty bucks. Mm -hmm. You can get the D two and Micarta version for sixty. Which I don't know why we didn't get. They we were the ones that told everybody about it, and now it's sold out. 
They sold out. Yeah. They did, yeah. Let me see if I can middle flick this one. You're getting caught. Oh, you're yeah. right. I did it. But no, that these is are, sweet. These are cool. These are gentlemen's carry. They are tipped down. I take offense to that. You take offense to the tip down? No, I take offense to you saying gentlemen's carry. Gentle persons. Gentle lady. You're not annoying like that, though. No, I know. Okay. Yeah, that's the CRKT CEO. Uh -huh. All right, what else we got? Grab something. Um, rat. Sure. Okay, any number of rats. Uh -huh. You yeah. can get your father-in-law a rat if you want to get this him for This is the Christmas. Ontario brand. This is the mini version. The rat one or two. You can get them in D2. You can get them in, I forget what the other steels are. There's a million colors, too. So that's what they have going for them a lot, too. A lot of different colors on these. Yeah, great knife. What do they start at? Um, Twenty-seven dollars. Yeah. Twenty-seven dollars, and they go up to maybe sixty if you get fancy the full ones. size in D two or something. Yeah. A yeah. fancy rat. Good knife. Okay. Let's Great just choice. Go to another essay. Similar. The Zancudo. Yeah. Which the, is actually mosquito. And if you if you forget, there's a picture on there to of show the you. Mosquito. So this is Os eight. That's actually what those might be. This one's D2 right now. But yeah, uh, yeah but the, the basic steels, though. Yeah, probably. Okay, so Aus 8 on these, full thumb studs. It's a steel frame lock with G10 on the one side, or maybe that might be some kind of a... Plastic. More of a polymer. <laughs> um, these are great. Yeah. These Lots of great. colors, too. Yeah. Tons of options in these. Kind of the same thing as the Rat. What do these start at? About mm, the same, really. Yeah, they really are. Right about the same. I want to say they start around maybe as low as 25, 27, somewhere in there. Okay, what else we got in here? You can pretty much choose any Ganzos. We got a couple of Ganzos. Well, they have their flippers too, yeah. but with the the Axis Lock Ganzos, call it twenty to thirty dollars. You can get them. Yeah. If you that get that one's the, really good. If you get the Slow Boat from China, you can pay <laughs> probably less than twenty yeah. per knife. So next year you might get your Ganzo. That'd be pretty soon. Yeah. Well, no, I didn't mean. I meant twenty twenty one. That's two weeks from now. 2021. Okay. But Ganzos, I mean, you can get them as low as, I don't know, 15 to $30, really. They're very fidgety. They might be good for creating that addiction. If, if you're talking gift. Yeah. Because then you this get the access lock, too. This isn't necessarily gift. A lot of people are watching this to get something for themselves. Oh, true. Gift yourself. But yeah, plenty of Ganzo options out there. Hmm. Actually, new Ganzo video on the way. You and what? I should get rid of these guys too. The reason why we brought them in is there's some spider codes out there that you can get. A Delica is just above this price range generally. For full retail. $78 is what they usually go for. But we've bought Delicas for used for like 30 bucks. Yeah. So if you can find a Delica for used, get one because they're, a, you know, awesome. Of it's course. a good option. It's a great option. Yeah. Um, on that same note, we'll just set this there The mini now. grip. This is Benchmade Griptilian. When you could get them in the 154 cm, yeah, I thought you could get a mini grip for around 80. I thought so too. I thought it was like 75 to 90 or so. Yeah. But so that means you might be able to find them used for that price in that price range too. Right. But that right. kind of does knock them out a little bit. Very good option. Very good option. The only Spyderco that we actually have in that price point, technically, well, we have the lady. is a dragon bug. Oh. <laughs> the dragon bug? The <laughs> dragon bug. He's a dangerous bug. He's a dragon bug. I was going to say we have the lady bug. Yeah, that's true. But they're just tiny. Yeah. yeah. This is a great knife. Good backup knife. Good backpack. Uh, throw it in a kit, that kind of thing. Keychain. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are great. Million colors. Any number of Spydercos, if you can get them in that price range. Yeah. But the Dragonfly is technically in there. It's 50 to $60. Okay. This one's big on my list. It's sitting off in the corner. It shouldn't be anymore. Just this chilling. is the Stediman BPO2. This thing is awesome. Yeah. You gave quite a photo shoot to him yesterday. On Instagram? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Definitely follow us on Instagram. When we're not posting on YouTube, we're posting on Instagram. Yep. This has the best action out of all of these. Excluding maybe this one, but button locks are different. Oh, you know what? I just now remembered one that we didn't get out. What's that? The CRKT Titac 2 Tanto. But he it technically has a button. It Oh, it has a flipper, you mean? It has Yeah, it has, it has a, a flipper. flipper. I thought yeah, about him, true. but he does okay. have a flipper because he has he's a three-way. True, true. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, BPO2. See our video on this one, but maybe we should do another video on it. This knife is awesome. They come in some cool colors, including an orange and black. Oh, that would be better. This I one's believe. kind of lame. 
But the action yeah. is the best. It does have good action. I'll give you that. Okay. Go that there. Yeah, thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five dollars. Get these anymore? Poker Nano? Yeah. I'm not sure. It's what everybody calls the cilantro trucker. It's what you call the cilantro trucker. Well, it trademarked itself. Yeah, let's show that one real quick. How much are they? Um, I don't even know anymore. I thought they were like fifty, sixty bucks. Fifty or sixty? Mm-hmm. For four forty C. Yeah. It's just a cool little it's kind of more of like a the, well not sure anymore, but there used to be a ton of options on yeah. this. So check them out. I think they've out. slowly just disappeared. If the design speaks to you, definitely check them out. They're cool. Yeah. So there's probably a lot of cold steel options, but we got rid of our cold steels we, a couple yes, years we back. Did. No, I, I love they're they're great. They're great. Mm -hmm. This one is the tough light. I still really like that knife. I use this one for a bathroom remodel quite a bit. What is that on there? Is it's it probably just... drywall. Oh, okay. No, these are awesome. How much are these? Um, the tough lights. Well, still, probably around thirty. Yeah, I, I know that they have the green and brown version of them yeah. too, which is nice. And they've got different. They've got a mini from here. Yeah, the yeah. mini might be a little too small for me. What else you got? That's oh, what she said. that's yeah. Recon or, one. Is this the micro? More of a keychain knife, but I did carry this every day for over a year. Yeah. These are. 30, 20 bucks? 20, 20 or 30, somewhere in there. Or you can get them for like $5, like us. And you can hang your car off of it. It's got the triad. Yeah. Um, no, good knife. Yep. Yeah. Cubies? There's two wood cubies that we have right here. There's this wood cubie <laughs> in D2. And then this one that kind of has that. I don't know. It's got some look. belly. It's got some Spider Co. ripoff. It's got some. a little bit of everything. Yeah. This one? I don't even know the model name. I forget. Somebody can put that. It's just the, it's a reversible thumb stud, but it's only on one side. But it has great action. I want a lot of Kubis are in that price range. 20-ish? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Liner lock. What is this steel? D2. This is D2? Yeah. This is China D2. Mm-hmm. Shout out. Yes. Yeah. No, they're cool. They're cool. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of Kubis in that price range. Yeah. Of the 20 to $40 range. So there's what we have. Uh, I mean, there's plenty more out there. P post them in comments. This is everything that we could find in our collection that kind of fits that category. You know what's funny that we don't have, and people always mention it? That does not in is not included in the bunch. Does the Makora fit? No, it doesn't. But one thing that does... Microtech? Spyderco's yeah. budget line. I'm handing you this. Okay. Yeah. Spyderco's budget line, the birds. The reason why we've never bought a bird... No, set it down. I'm, you don't have to just hold it for the rest of the video. I was going to point with it. Yeah, but, don't do um, that. The Spyderco birds, those, there's always a bunch of them in that price range, too. B-Y-R-D. That's the reason why we have not bought any. It's the wrong spelling. It does not. It's just, we'd have to describe why it's spelled wrong and it's just more yeah different problems. topic no there's there's a couple more that let's get to before we're uh, oh, finished here yep cjrb so this is a spin-off brand or a budget brand off of the artisan line that's true yes centros the centros is this a mallory design yeah yeah, yeah. okay new designer here we met him at the 2019 shot show good design mm -hmm. yep. good design these go for how much 35 bucks 35 dollars is what they yep. start at Liner lock, thumb studs. What's the steel? Mm, I think they're D2. Yeah, they are. D2. Yeah. So not yeah, bad. That's a good not one bad. Too. Similar design. And then we got the steel wheel. Similar. Oh. Gina. Here. Yes, that's true. This is the Gina. I was just thinking about all the other steel wheels, but those are all flippers. Like the yeah. Modus and all the cut jacks and all yeah. of them. This, is, this has got solid action. Yeah. Really does. But a little bit more expensive. More expensive Gina there. Yeah, all right. 64 bucks. This video is going for way too long. Okay. okay. We got to quickly wrap it up. Okay. Pick your favorite. Pick my favorite? Yeah, assume they're all priced at $35. They're all the same price. Okay. What's your favorite? Mm, can I have two? No. <sighs> Fine, go ahead. I'm going to choose the mini big light dark. Yeah. And I really like the CEO. Okay. I'm going to have to go with the bag letter full size. Really, or the Doman. But I'm going to go with this one just because it was first. Yeah. And it's got my edge on there. Um... Like that, and right here, the Stedman BPO2. That's and that is thirty-five dollars. Yeah, that's crazy. Those are our favorites. Yeah. 
There's so many good options. In there really game. is. But that's what we came up with. Did we choose the wrong ones? I don't know. You guys let us know. No. What? You said only two. Uh, okay. Fine. That's frustrating, isn't it? Yes, it's yeah. a stupid, stupid game. All right, let us know. Let us know, do you gift them, and how well does that go over? Don't, I mean, this is this is for non-flippers. Flippers are great, though. Flippers are amazing. Flippers are addicting. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> thanks a lot for joining us. Bye. It's Knife Menage à Toi. Ooh, kinky. All right. Taking a look at some, don't know where I'm going with this.